Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So last week I made a video where I used my sim here, Norma, and we opened a little, well I guess you could call it a salon. Basically gave some makeovers to some of my randomly generated townies, or some of my own townies who had lost some of their custom content along the way, who were walking around my worlds looking like a hot mess. We saved the lives, or the fashion lives, of five sims last week. And I was just going to do it as a one-off episode, but I actually had quite a lot of fun doing that. So, also I noticed by the time I left the salon and finished my shift, there were still so many, so many helpless townies looking like trash warmed up. So I thought me and Norma would go on another rescue mission today and we would save five more. So that's basically the plan for the video. We're gonna go to our salon, we're gonna open up shop and hopefully we're gonna give five more makeovers to some pretty desperate looking sibs. So you know what Norma, let's travel to our salon very early in the morning but we like to get an early start. If you saw some of the townies we worked on last week, well, we're basically a miracle worker, so we've got to get up early, open up. Also, a lot of it is kind of based on chance because not all townies, you know, are mismatched and stuff. Some of them are just the general townies, so we kind of have to wait around a while until we see one that is clearly, clearly just randomly generated or missing clothing items. Go and relax while we wait for some customers. Take it easy. That's right, that's nice. The spa stuff isn't just for the customers, Norma. And now we wait. We've been open for coming on to an hour now and no one's come in yet. Oh, okay, okay, we got some sims. Right, seeing a few mismatched sims here. This one doesn't even know what she's doing. She's standing inside the other one. This guy's wearing an outdoor jacket with a shirt tied around his waist. This one though, Natalie Potter, she, she doesn't look terrible. I mean, that does look okay, she looks fine. I think this lady, Aurora, I think she needs our help. What what gave her the idea to wear floral leggings with a knitted jumper? I don't know. So we'll have a word with her and then we might also help Lawson snickle pitch. Another day of turning notties into hotties. Am I right, Norma? Yeah, I'm right. Yeah, pretty mismatched. Crimson shirt with red trainers. What should we do with Aurora? She looks like she's an adult. All right, let's take a look at you, Aurora. You look like you've had a little bit of lip filler done. Yeah, it's really accentuated your smile lines there. Let's just take your hair off first and see what we're working with. Can we change those eyebrows? Let's see what we got here. Those initial ones, they look like quite angry eyebrows. Let's try and soften them up a little bit, yeah. If you're wondering why I'm doing this, I did explain it in the first video, but basically I'm getting a bit sick of uh, moving a sim into a neighborhood and then whenever I want them to make a friend or get a partner I always have to go into create a sim and make some sims for my sim because the ones that just wander around town just look ridiculous oh this is nice so I'm now on a mission to um, try and make the townies around me look a little bit more you know stylish so that I don't have to create as many sims because right now these townies walk around looking ridiculous taking up my townie space um, oh, we're on your outdoor outfit, aren't we? Okay, maybe we'll just get you some boots to stick under there. I usually do um, outdoor and every day, but I think probably I should do hot weather as well because those are the only outfits you really notice when townies are walking around. I mean, this is kind of cute. Maybe with a little beanie hat or something. Oh, you look absolutely adorable. What's your summer wear like? Okay bit tragic I'm gonna let's do your everyday first just so we can get that hairstyle like locked in stick on some lashes of course it has to be done beautiful what about our everyday I quite like the idea of putting her in orange although this looks kind of cute the blue hmm I mean if we did wear this what would we wear it with star print jeans I mean that could work it's a bit plain but it could work I mean, these are only townies wandering around. I think the flared jeans are the things I kind of prefer the most. I always find it's difficult to like pair something with a peplum top, but I do really like this top, so I think we're gonna go for this. And of course, we'll treat you. Get your nails done. There we go. Maybe a necklace, something like that. I think the moon necklace might be my favorite necklace in the whole game. Little bit of lip gloss, little bit of blush. Okay, that's your everyday, your winter, and then for summer, we'll just do something basic. I'm not really a fan of those shorts. Maybe like a little 
Oh, this is cute. Maybe something like this, and then some flip flops. We've got to get your flippy floppies. And then some flippy floppies, and of course, some shades. And uh, maybe just a little bit of gloss as well. Perfect. If I saw this sim walking around in the summer, I would assume she was one of my own. This knotty has definitely become a hottie. Okay, who else? Who else desperately needs my help? Oh, that's right, it was uh, Lawson. Offer to update appearance. Lawson Snicklepitch. It's gotta be you, man. It's gotta be you. I might do an entire series of this, you know? So that everyone, like every single person in my save file, has style. I wouldn't touch the, the actual pre-made townies. Just the randomly generated ones. Like this fucker over here. Okay, we're gonna start with your everyday, which isn't too bad. I think you could do with a little bit of an updated look though. I think maybe we'll dye your hair something a little bit richer, like a dark brown. Go with your, your eyes, maybe style it a bit different. Probably give a bit more fullness to those eyebrows. This sim looks so tired, doesn't he? You may have had a hard life, but you don't wanna look like you've had one. So that's you without facial hair. I think we do wanna go for some facial hair. Maybe this. Okay, I'm thinking something classy for him. I'm definitely thinking like a shirt because he looks like... He looks like the type of guy you'd see down the golf club who might just work a nine to five or something. So I feel like I wanna kind of dress him for that. I know this shirt is a bit plain, but I think he's kind of a plain guy. I don't know why he's got rips in his jeans. He it definitely doesn't seem to me the type of guy that would walk around with ripped jeans. I think let's just keep it plain for you, all right? So this can just be your like casual going down the pub look. But would he wear trainers? I don't know, I don't know if he would wear trainers. I actually feel like he might wear loafers, but not fancy loafers, something a bit more like this. I think we would choose comfort over fashion. So maybe just something real simple, just that. There we go, slip-ons, all right. I'm scared to look at your hot weather outfit, but what are you wearing for this? Okay. This isn't terrible, actually. It's not terrible. I don't know if you think you're a surfer guy with that necklace, but we're going to take it off. Uh, we will give you some shades. You obviously have the enthusiasm to be cool, so I will let you feel cool with some shades. There we go. The t-shirt I don't actually hate. I don't hate the t-shirt. I think you're on the right page with the t-shirt. But I think maybe just some plain shorts. In fact, there are some, like... Something like this, maybe, but not not so bright. So, so just some plain roll-ups, I think. Oh, these are like the dad shorts. Do you know what? I, I'm actually going to let you go for a pattern as well, because I feel like when the sun comes out, that's when you express yourself. And the trainers are fine. I actually think the trainers fit in with your vibe very well. Okay, that's not terrible. What about outdoor wear? What are we wearing? Oh, yeah, that's right. It was a monstrosity. That's how I found you, wasn't it? Forgot about that. Okay, see I've always really liked this jacket that's got the scarf on it. It's quite classy, quite classic, quite a mature look. I can't focus with those trousers on, I'm going to take them off. Although this is quite sweet as well. This is giving like dad on a dating site. I'm just trying to stay away from anything edgy with this guy. I feel like very much playing it safe. Do you know what, I think I'm going to stick with this. It's neutral tone, beige, pretty safe look and maybe just some plain jeans. I don't think we would be wearing boots. I usually put my cold weather sims in boots, but I don't think you're a boots guy. Maybe like short boots, but definitely not like high boots or ski boots or anything. Just something sim, there we go. Yeah, Ron Swanson shoes, perfect. You've gone from a knotty to a hottie. Oh, he looks like one of my own. All right, let's go, let's give you a makeover. Okay, so this is your outdoor look. What's your everyday? Okay, you're a pretty heavily tattooed guy. I actually think this is one of mine, because he has, like, that kind of suits his look, and then he's got his formal wear. I don't know, some of his outfits are mismatched, but some of them aren't. I feel like this might be my sim. I feel like the everyday is okay. That definitely suits his vibe. I mean, he looks like he's hanging out on Muscle Beach or going to the gym or something. So I think really you only need a makeover for your outer and for your outside, for your cold weather and hot weather outfits. So let's take this hat off. For hot weather I feel like you would definitely wear sunnies. I get the impression you think you're a bit too cool for all this so I think that requires some aviators. 
I feel like he might even go topless, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Definitely some of those. I don't know what they're called. They're pretty big in America. You don't really see them much in the UK, but they're like shorts that are like flared out. People wear them a lot with jerseys. I can't remember what they're called, but they're like baseball. They're like basketball shorts, maybe? A little bit like this, but I don't see any... I think probably what I just had was probably the closest thing, these. But maybe in like, yeah, like a, a swatch like that. Or maybe just black and white and then... And a shirt like this. There we go. That's your hot weather wear. Could also be your workout wear. And then for cold weather, I think we'll take off some of these accessories. Would we wear a hat? I'm not sure if we would wear a hat, you know. I don't think we're a hat guy. Definitely not a patterned flares guy. Maybe like, uh, maybe some joggers actually. Maybe like some trackies. Yeah, I think these could be the type. Some trackies, still, dr still trainers. Wear our same pair of high top. That might be a bit too classy. Possibly this, this could work. Or maybe a hoodie. I don't think he'd wear a machino hoodie. I think we'll go for this, okay. Perfect. So your everyday was already fine, so now you have a new hot weather outfit. And cold weather. Beautiful. Okay, anybody else? Anybody else? What about this sim out here? Is she is she pregnant? I'll come and do an introduction to you. I think you could do with a new hairstyle. I really don't like that hairstyle. Okay, we will offer Amy an update. She's paparazzi as well. Amy, you should really make more effort. Oh, has she disappeared? Cheeky bitch, she left before I could even give her- Maybe it was because she was paparazzi, so she just spawned away? I don't know. Okay, well, Natalie, you've earned yourself a free makeover. She doesn't really look that mismatched, but you know what? She could do with a little bit of an overhaul, so we'll give her a, a fresh new look. What is it with people dressing like clowns lately? Okay, I don't remember your name, but let's take a look at your everyday. Okay, I don't think she is one of mine. I would not have dressed her in this, so she's not- she's just a randomly generated townie. What about hot weather? Okay, mess. And outerwear- okay, so your outerwear is actually probably the most sensible look you've got going on. But I don't hate it. You're, you're obviously communicating your style here, like Mean Girls era. And that's fine, we can work with that, we can work with that. I think we probably will dye your hair, maybe just something a little bit more golden rather than just cheese. Okay, we'll see if we can find something that keeps some of your natural curls, okay? It might not be as tight, but how about something like this? That way you keep your natural curls, but they just look a little bit more styled. You know what, I actually don't mind her eyebrows either. We'll keep them. Obviously, we're gonna need some lashes. Perfect. So she wants to wear a pink top, so let's see. Let's see what I have in our wardrobe. Thinking it's obviously got to be something like really feminine. That seems to be the look she's trying to go for. I mean, something like that, that could work. This top here. Maybe like the playful bunny. I feel like there's less pink stuff than I remember. This is kind of cute. We could go with this. I think I, I think I prefer this one though. Unless we could find like a nice dress. I think we'll stick with the top and then find like a skirt that goes with it and then maybe just change the swatch on her shoes. Because we do still have to do her weather outfits too. Could maybe choose a pattern skirt to go with this. In fact, I feel like I had a skirt that would be perfect for this. Okay, you know what? I've just gone rogue and decided actually, we're just gonna dress as a brat style. We're gonna wear the star jeans. Just some light makeup. Okay, I think that's your everyday done. What's your hot weather outfit again? Oh yeah, okay. Trying to be Britney. Get rid of the eyeball ring. I think for you, maybe just a pattern dress, or actually, maybe the Barbie play suit. Purple looks good. Okay, there's your summer wear. I think actually we better do, just stick on some summer nails. Just some nice, nice summer nails there. Okay, beautiful, you're ready for summer. And then winter. Okay, like I said, there's nothing actually wrong with your winter wear. It's just a little bit basic for what seems to be your taste. So I think we'll go heavy on the lippy. Okay. And outerwear wise. Do we have these in pink? No. Could just wear the Uggs though. 
Or maybe these. Yeah. Okay, you're a little bit more ready. Okay, you've got your everyday, your hot weather, and your cold weather. You're welcome. We really are doing the Lord's work today. Okay, we just need one more Sim who needs a makeover. Is that the paparazzi still there? Okay, let's see if we can try her again. Is she coming? Yes, okay, finally, I knew you'd say yes. Okay, this paparazzi definitely needs a makeover. By the time we're done with you, the celebrities will be flocking your way. You won't even have to ask for a photo. Uh, Jesus Christ. Girl. Is this your, your every day? You're wearing a Del Boy hat. I mean, you look ridiculous. You know that, right? Okay. Well, first things first, if you're going to be walking around trying to get people to take you seriously, you're obviously in the business. You need a pair of smart heels. Okay, that's step one. We're working from the ground up this time. Step two, I'm thinking maybe plaid trousers, but in more of a deep colour. Mm, I'm not sure, actually. I don't know. Maybe plaid trousers aren't for you, but that's fine. That's why I'm here. Okay, as your stylist, we'll find something that works for you. Don't you worry, we'll get there. Even if we have to try on everything in store. These could work. These could work. Or even, you know what? I really like these. I'm not sure about the colour yet. We'll have to see if we can find a top to match. I mean, this is kind of cute. Do we want it in black though? We could go a bit more charcoal or grey. Let's go grey because our hair is black. We don't want to be dressed too dark. We want to have some colour. Okay, let's change those eyebrows. Get them a little bit more defined. If you want people to take you seriously, you know. Eyebrows have to be a priority. I don't make the rules. Okay, better, better. I mean, even just like shorter, even just like shoulder length hair could really do you wonders. Or even this, updo. I think this will be the hairstyle we go for. We definitely need some lashes. Oh, maybe even some earrings, seeing as your ears are so exposed. Okay, okay. Nice natural lip gloss, little bit of blush. Okay, that's your every day. What a transformation, you look so much better. All right, I'm afraid to see what you're wearing in hot weather, but let's go. Oh yeah, I already saw this. Okay, hot weather. Maybe some shorts, some nice sandals, and just a nice summer top. Quite like the mint, let's go mint. And then we'll just stick some shades on you. Okay, and then finally winter weather. Maybe something like this, and then some boots like that. Okay, beautiful. So now you've got your everyday, your hot weather, and your cold weather. You're welcome. So that's five more sims we've made over, five more ridiculous looking townies that I'll no longer have to stumble across in my game. So on that note, I think I'm going to end this video here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.